Hi everyone, it's Anne from Anne Ellis Angels and here are your angel card readings for the coming week. These are general readings, so take from them everything that resonates with you. Leave behind anything else, but most importantly, enjoy the readings and have a really positive week. Libra, here are your cards from the Teacup Tarot deck for the week starting the 28th of August. And your overall energy is lovely. The three of teacups is about celebrations. It's about happiness. It's about joy. It's about social invitations. So what a lovely overall energy for you this week. Your help or your hurdle. The eight of teacups reminds you to take things one step at a time. On the card, look, she's poised at the edge. Success is just there, right in front of her. But she just needs to take things one step at a time. If she hops onto this first stepping stone, the next one's in front of her. And when she does that, she'll get to the success simply and easily. So taking things a step at a time. Your guidance here upsteps the king of teacups. Now, the kings are authority figures in the deck and the king of teacups is absolutely lovely, absolutely personifies loving kindness, generosity, sharing. Very often in a role of a volunteer or working in a charitable organisation, some sort of role where other people are helped and other people feel better. So this lovely overall energy of loving kindness and compassion and sharing, you are asked to embrace those qualities this week. How can we help ourselves? The six of teacups. Now, this keeps showing up in other signs this week as well. It's a card of the past principally. So it's remembering the past with love, it's reminiscing, it's remembering, but also the meaning of the card is it's you doing what you've always wanted to do. And look on the card. She's remembering when her little dog here was a tiny puppy. Look how far they've come now. They've won the championships. So very much that sort of energy, realising how far you've come and realising how well you're doing. Pulling it all together, the seven of coins is about planting seeds, doing the groundwork, making sure that those action steps are taken. And then, no need to worry, just wait and know that the success will show at the divine and appropriate timing. And your final outcome card is lovely. Here's your new beginning. Here's your new chapter opening up. This is a card of transformation. This is a card of wonderful new beginnings. So just looking at the tarot cards. Happiness, joy and a reason to celebrate this week. Take things a step at a time. Do the groundwork. Get those seeds planted, take those first action steps. It might be on a subject or a project that you've always wanted to do. When you use the qualities of loving kindness, compassion and sharing to light your way, here then steps up. Here's the brand new beginning and the wonderful new chapter. So let's get a little bit more information from the Time to Shine deck. The Ten of Thought is about you moving on, being happy. It's telling you that the situation is improving. The Sixteen of Wisdom is about making some positive life changes. It's focusing on what you do well. It's doing what you love and loving what you do but being prepared to make those positive changes to get you there. And the three of emotion, we've got a double message, same card, different deck. Celebrating good news, exactly as I was saying here. The seven of life, another double message. These are messages coming through from the lovely angels in capital letters. 
Give it time, all is well, but plant those seeds now. Do the groundwork. The two of life says keep life in balance. You might have lots going on. It also reminds you to make wise and sensible choices. You might have more than one option. You might have two options this week. Think them through carefully. Focus on balance. So that's work-life balance, financial balance, and making choices from a wise and well-informed place. And your final outcome card. This is a mindfulness card. And it says, avoid anybody else's drama. So if there's anything going on in the background that you don't need to be part of, leave it where it is. Focus on the sunshine. Focus on where you want to go. Stay positive and keep moving forward. So looking at the cards overall, your mindfulness homework is taking things a step at a time, doing the groundwork, getting those first action steps taken. Leave any drama in the background where it needs to be and be ready to make those positive life changes. Take things a step at a time because the celebration's here, the good news is here. You moving up that staircase of success and enjoying this fantastic new beginning. So I hope you've enjoyed the reading. If you have, please subscribe. Thank you for doing that. It makes a huge difference to me. And then you'll get notified when I do the next reading for you as well. So take care now and I'll see you soon.